it go. So Brielle and Wilson have left. Uh, that was a nice little visit after their school day, but their dad came and picked them up, and now they're home with their mom having a lovely supper. And uh, I sent them home with the harvest we made uh, earlier, the spinach and the basil. And we cleaned it just as I clean this now. And, oh, there we go. I'm going to get that grit through the bottom of the sculabasta here, the strainer. All right, there we are. And this is just what we want. Look at that clean root. Well, I might have to rinse it one more time, but I'm not afraid of a little dirt. The products I use are Omri listed, and we have taken away the colored mulch that uh, I'm told is not the best for the water. Anyway, um, I'm looking here at... That's my sink. I'm good at making dishes and tea, and then I'll get involved in this. Well, this is so much more fun right now. Um, this is Malabar spinach, and it's great at any stage, but that patch needed some thinning. As you saw earlier, it needed to be thinned, and it's great at any stage, as I say, but it's particularly tender and has a great, uh, a milder taste when it's younger. Now this is a little uh, older. You see the purple stem and the root, all of which are edible. Um, you see the leaves start to change. And uh, as it gets more mature, so does its taste and texture. And there's an even older leaf from an older generation. Uh, we did pick more spinach and basil. I'll have one quarter basil to three quarters spinach in this recipe, and that is with the rogota and the grated Parmesan cheese and the one egg with some salt and pepper, or maybe some oregano, just a dash. It'll make your dish bitter if you use too much, whether it's fresh or dry. That's the oregano I'm talking about. Well, anyway, uh, first I want to get this dry. Right here on the paper towel. Just like that. I'm going to dry it out a bit and make sure that uh, all the dirt and grit are off the leaf and stem. Now, this is what you want. Oh, the smell and the contact. I've got a little dirt under my nails because I have been in the garden between the showers we had today. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> I'll wash my hand a little bit. And uh, this is what it's about, enjoying the bounty and sharing the bounty.